Today I want to share with you all the foods that I eat in a day and the reason I eat all these foods is to give me lots of energy, really great health, vitality and anti-aging. So if you'd like to know more, please keep watching. Hi, I'm Shelley. This is Fabulous 50s, a lifestyle channel that explores fashion, beauty and lifestyle for women over 50. And if you're a woman over 50, click subscribe and click the bell and you'll be alerted every time there's a new video and they'll all relate to you. Today I wanted to share with you all the things that I eat because lots of people ask me what do I eat in a day. But I've got to tell you, you may find this really, really boring because when I go to my sister's place, she once presented me with a really nice platter made up of cardboard cutouts of pretend food because she thinks that the food I eat is really, really boring. So anyway, I'm going to share it with you nonetheless. And I want to share with you that health and nutrition is like a really high value for me. I value my health so much because I've had the opposite to health for many years and I've gone from healthy to unhealthy to healthy and now I've found things that really work for my body to give me optimal health and in the past I've had adrenal fatigue from so much stress and I've had uh, digestion problems and I've had you know feeling exhausted and lethargic and just generally unwell. So what I've done is I've done lots of research on foods that make me feel good and I've just stuck to it because although it's very disciplined and I don't have any processed foods, but in that discipline for me comes feeling good. And for me, feeling good way outweighs not feeling good and being unwell. So let me go through with you what I have. I have a first breakfast, what about second breakfast? A second breakfast, snacks, lunch and dinner. First thing I have when I get home from the gym is a smoothie. And all the ingredients of this smoothie taste good, combined, it's a good combination. And some days I have all of these products and some days I'll have a green smoothie and throw a whole lot of fresh produce into a blender and get it going. So I have a Vitamix blender and I fill the blender up 300 mils. And I put one scoop of protein powder. This is a vegetarian protein powder and it's full of amino acids and it doesn't have any fillers. This is going to provide me with a high dose of protein and it's going to be alkalizing and full of antioxidants. So one scoop of this, then I add one teaspoon of raw cacao to make it taste chocolate. It's all in the recipe. This is really yummy. Then I add a very heaped teaspoon of spirulina and I have this every single day because it's very high in protein. It's full of antioxidants. It's another superfood. It's going inside my body. It cleans out anything that shouldn't be there and I love this every single day. I have half a teaspoon of maca. I have this for my hormones to help regulate my hormones. I have one biotin capsule and I break the capsule in half so the powder goes into the smoothie. This is for my hair and nails, it's vitamin B7. Then I have half a teaspoon of glutamine, which is another anti-aging amino acids. I'm going to do a video on glutamine because it's a really great anti-aging supplement. So half a teaspoon of this. And then I use one scoop of perfect hydrolyzed collagen, which is more amino acids. So everything that's going into this smoothie has a reason behind it. And it gets me set up for the day, gives me lots of energy and it's yummy. Last thing I put in my smoothie is my broccoli sprouts that are frozen. So I'd put about half of that amount in and that is going to give me sulforaphane and I've just done a video on this and I'll leave a link up here to show you the benefits of this magic superfood that we should all be having at our age. So yep, I put that in and then turn the blender on, spin, spin, spin and it's best to keep the blender going for a little bit longer if you've got the broccoli sprouts in it so it all mixes up and it's smooth to drink. 
For my actual breakfast, I have these things. I make my own paleo bread. So this recipe for paleo toast is full of beautiful ingredients and you feel like you're full from eating toast or bread, but it's not doing any of the damage that gluten and grains can do to some people's bodies, which it does to mine. So I have toast and then on top of the toast I slice avocado and then on top of that I put sauerkraut and I make this myself. This is the easiest thing in the world to make and I'll leave a recipe on my website for this one. But this sauerkraut is really amazing for the gut and pretty much everything I eat is to give my gut the best chance at being healthy and strong. So fermented foods like sauerkraut are amazing to have in your diet. And I thought that I wouldn't like this, but I love it. And with these ingredients, they all balance each other out and it's beautiful. And then on top of that, I have my broccoli sprouts. So all this goes on top and it's this big and it's so delicious. Again, these are amazing. Watch the video on broccoli sprouts and the benefits of sulfurophane, you're going to want to try this for sure. So that's my breakfast. During the day when I'm hungry, I'll eat because I don't want to deprive myself and I'll just have sunflower seeds or raw cashews or raw almonds and I usually try and have some fruit. I eat the nuts for protein and good fats and I eat some fruit for fiber. So that's my snacks. I also drink aloe vera juice, which I make myself. And this is the plant, and I have a video on how to make this. This is amazing stuff for you to be putting inside your body. There's so many benefits of aloe juice. And I'll leave a link up here to show you the video on that. And for lunch and dinner, I'll eat these veggies. So I'll cook them in different ways. Some days I'll put it all through a juicer and have juice, and other days I'll put these veggies through my food processor and I'll do a stir fry or a soup or something like that. So that's about how much I would have. Sometimes I might have a little bit more, depends on how hungry I am. And for flavoring, I'll just have Himalayan rock salt and pepper, lemons and coconut oil will go in most things because at most meals I'll have some sort of healthy fat with what I'm eating and nothing beats coconut oil for keeping your skin really healthy and if you've got dry skin like I have, this taken internally is amazing for dry skin because when you don't have it, you notice it's missing. So I'll have that every day. Another thing I might snack on is olives and the, the meat from the olives is really great for our hair and our skin and our eyes. But make sure if you're going to eat olives for health benefits, the olives just without any treatment at all are much better for you. Another thing I'll have over my veggies or in my veggies is linseed. When you eat linseeds just like this, you don't receive the benefits of all the goodness that's in them, all the beautiful oils. You have to mill them. And then when you mill them, they become active and then you put them in your body and it starts doing the work. Plus, every day I drink one and a half to two of these, two litre bottles of water. I use an alkalized water purifier which oxygenates the water and I believe that's amazing for adding extra hydration. So and for sweet things, I have my homemade chocolate and I'll leave a recipe up here for that. This is amazing. You make it yourself. It's super, super easy. Everything here is so easy to make. And this will fight any sugar cravings you have because it's natural sugar. It tastes amazing. It fills you up and it stops the cravings. So check this recipe out because you're going to love that too. So that's everything I eat in a day. I also take lots of vitamins and other supplements to keep me strong and healthy. I don't really eat anything other than this. I don't have sugar or coffee or processed foods because they don't make me feel good. And I understand that it's very, very difficult to give those things up. But for me, it was an easy thing to do and it's easy to be disciplined because I'm feeling great. So thank you so much for watching. Please give a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video.
and share it with any of your friends who might be interested in eating a more healthy diet so you can start feeling great and have lots of energy and feel really good every single day. Thank you so much for watching and have a beautiful week.